I would say not today, frankly, but rather tomorrow morning, because we expect the real estate market, which is really under severe pressure at the moment, to recover uh, because of a conjunction of elements. One is the uh, expected reduction of interest rates, um, which should really act as a catalyst for many investors who today want to invest, but are just waiting for the economic equation to improve. And the real estate asset class is still a very attractive one in the long term. It's an obvious uh, protection against inflation. And today we are living in an inflation environment. So I'm quite optimistic on the real estate asset class, uh, notwithstanding all the headwinds that we have been experiencing over the last months. Um, so let's invest into real estate going forward. Thank you. The members of UEL are all involved in uh, housing in different uh, uh, cases. Uh, banks and uh, craftsmen or um, real estate agents, uh, architects, engineers, everyone has another problem or uh, other solutions uh, for the, uh, the topic of the uh, housing problem. So we want to coordinate it and, uh, and give to the government uh, the real solutions to the problems and uh, hopefully they will hear us and, uh, and we will go uh, along and, and uh, find, have real results uh, in the discussions with the government. Well, despite the fact that um, member states did not agree on the uh, final draft of ATA3 directive, we still believe ATA3 will come back in the future. And currently, this is one of the hottest topics on my desk uh, to make sure that uh, we comply and we uh, in line with the future requirements of uh, the law um, as it seems right now. Um, and believe that it will be a big game changer in the future. And we're looking forward to see what the, the future will bring. Luxreal stands for real estate, Alfi stands for real estate investment funds, among other topics. Bringing both together, helping our members capitalize on industry trends is key. Alfi was founded in 1988, has got more than 1,500 investment funds as its members, and our key goals are helping capitalize on industry trends, shaping regulation, fostering professional standards, but also promoting Luxembourg and the investment fund space. Real estate and real estate funds are an important topic. We see growing demand for alternative investments and private assets. Alternative investments do already and will appear more and more as building blocks in pension solutions, for example. Real estate is a strong pillar in the alternative investment fund sector and Luxembourg is a strong jurisdiction with a global reputation for reefs. Today we talked about private assets, retailization of private assets and the LTIF. The LTIF being of paramount importance also for real estate asset managers, building future products for their investors. We want to thank Luxreal for having invited us. So I think one of the most important things that we're going to need to be dealing with with tax and real estate in Europe is beneficial ownership. It is so fundamental in how we structure our assets and we have seen a massive shift in the way that tax authorities are dealing with this. Um, and the way that we are seeing a shift means that we've got concerns about getting our access to treaties, getting access to um, the directives and I think there is more uncertainty and change to come.
Yeah.